today. <laughs> uh, tens of thousands of fans are heading to Minneapolis in the next 48 hours. Yeah, so Eva is downtown right now. She's talking about uh, some downtown businesses who are banking on fans to help with their bottom line. Yeah, it's on the mind downtown. In fact, driving here, we saw a billboard that said Beach Taylor's boyfriend. So very much what CC was talking about. But downtown here, businesses like O'Donovan's here say that major sporting events like these are honestly what's keeping some businesses alive. We're not just talking O'Donovan's. We're talking other restaurants and bars in the area, hotels as well, and all small businesses that have been suffering ever since the pandemic. So we spoke with the owner of O'Donovan's who said the overall loss of business downtown post COVID means they can't be open every day of the week anymore. He told us some nights it's more profitable to close altogether than to pay to turn on the lights and only sell a few beers. Now the nights the twins swept the Blue Jays, he nearly quadrupled his cash flow. No twins playoff. We might do three to four thousand a day like yesterday is a twenty thousand dollar day so it's a huge you know and we're just one small little pub so good news for keeping their doors open we also spoke with other restaurant managers here in the area who said it's events like these that help them get through the more painful business days and honestly gives them a glimmer of hope that downtown could be on the up and up guys back to you